The Patriot Armour modular vehicle has been built in large numbers for the home and export market. In fact, over 95% of production has been for the export market and is also being manufactured under license in a number of countries, including Poland, the Rossomat, and more recently South Africa. Further developed has resulted in the Patriot AMV XP. And what does XP mean? Extra performance, extra payload, and extra protection. This particular vehicle is the latest one shown, and as you will see, mounted on the top there is the Norwegian Konsberg MCT-30 remote control turret, which is armed with good old 30mm Mark 44 cannon and a 7.62 co-action machine gun plus grenade launcher. And if you look on the roof, you'll see a Konsberg protector remote weapon station armed with a 50 cal machine gun and mounted on the side of that is a Raytheon Lockheed Martin Javelin anti-tank guided weapon and that allows targets to be engaged at a range of well over four kilometres. But it has an extra armour protection and another feature, it's got an unmanned aerial vehicle. So this one is being marketed alongside the AMV for those users who want that more payload and more protection. Um, it's fully developed now and, and is ready for production and is already being marketed to a number of overseas countries. In addition, this vehicle has cameras for 360-degree situation awareness. Those cameras can send images to display screens at the commander station, the gunner station, the driver station, even the dismounts in the back. So when the dismounts leave the vehicle, they have some idea of what's happening around them. Another feature, this, is, this turret system is crewed by two people, commander and gunner. Each of them can aim and lay, lay the main armor onto the target and using the protector as a hunter-killer site. So the commander could first find the target. If it's hostile, he would switch over and let the gunner engage the target. The earlier generation turret with just one person is actually fitted on striker infantry carry vehicles armed with an XM813 cannon. And also, Gatar will order a large number of BBCIs and some of those will be fitted with the Norwegian Konsberg MCT, which in fact has been fitted on a wide range of other platforms.